Hi guys, Kelly here. Um, I was gonna bring, I'm bringing you another palette today, and this is the Rock Nudes by Maybelline, and uh, they don't have any uh, certain like names or anything like that, but they're really pretty. And I have done another video. I did another video on this, uh, much like I did the Galactic Eyes. But I want to give it a really good test, so my eyes are already primed, and um, we're just going to do a really cute look real quick that kind of matches my shirt, just kind of neutral, and uh, we'll I'll keep checking back throughout the day and let you know what I think of this as the day goes on. So let me do an eye look. Actually, we'll go ahead and do it with you right now. So, have you ever gotten to the point in your in your uh, makeup brushes where you've used so many of them and haven't washed them that now you have to wash them and you have none? So if you're using like ones that aren't good. Not that they're not good, because they are good, they're just they're the ones I use at the least. So the last time I tested this, there was a lot of fallout, so let's hope that that isn't the case, since I don't have any bake on, and my shirt is brand new. <clears throat> so I think I'm going to use, go in with this color right here for my face. It's really, really powdery, so... Well, no fallout so far. Okay, and now I want to use this shimmery, like, rose color. I'm going to pop that on with this brush right here, which is just a brush I got out of the Galactic Eyes kit, or palette, not kit. That's so unimpressive. So, that's nothing, you can barely tell that I have anything on. So I'm going to try some fixative setting. So yeah, the fixative spray isn't helping. So this is technically my fourth layer of trying to build this color up. And I'm getting nothing. It's, it's just, it's nothing. And I am really digging in there, guys. Now you probably can't tell, but there is a considerable amount of fallout in this to this eye. But I was being aggressive, but I did the thing. All right, and now let's see here. 
I'm going to take <clears throat> mm. you can't see <laughs> so I'm going to take this gold shimmery color right here I'm going to pop that into my crease I don't have a fluffer brush to really blend, blend this out, but, and then, um, I'll go ahead and put this white shade right here into my, up on my brow bone, although I usually like shimmer up on my brow bone. that's been used. I am officially out of non-lip liner brushes. Uh, I guess I'll just... <laughs> so, I have to use my foundation brush for a fluffy brush, so... It's just, it's just not wowing me, you know, it's just not making me go, oh my god, I can't, I can't live without this palette, I need it. I mean, even the Galactic Eyes actually wowed me a little bit, because it got, it was so intense. But this is just not, there's, I feel like there's barely anything on my eyes. So guys, that's going to be it. Um, I'll check back in with you later today, a couple times today, and we'll see. And this is what what we got so far. Hi guys, so I'm back again with the uh, a check in, and uh, if this is a review on the eyeliner I used, uh, I would suck. <coughs> Anyways. Um, I'll bring I'll come in close and here is the eyeliner and if you want I mean look at that this is the worst eyeliner I've ever used it's a good thing it's again not a review on the eyeliner anyway so um, this is basically the look that I started with it really hasn't moved around much um, it's just not very bright, and again, I know you're like, well, they're nudes, and you use nude, nude shades, but it's just not popping, you know, and for a shimmering shade, I would really like it to pop. My lipstick is almost gone. Um, not going to reapply, um, so I'm not going anywhere else today. But, <clears throat> except the fallout that I had, and the, um, and fall thumbs, and the fact that it's not, like, wowing me and bright, then, yeah. And if you want to know what, um, eyeliner I've been using lately. That's not it. Let me find it. No, that's not it. That's not it. Here it is. I have two of these. Um, because they were cheap. <laughs> There's a reason why they was cheap, you know what I'm saying? Goodness sakes. 
Guess it is in here, right? Okay, so it must be somewhere on my table, but, um, this is what I've been using for my lips, it, or my eye, eye it's L'Oreal Voluminous Smoldering Eyeliner, and it's a really nice thick pen, pencil, and I was really, really hoping, and it's really creamy and really easy to use, and it's a nice dark, I mean, it's really, really nice. But, and you'd think, oh, look, Kelly, it's not moving. But it is. It's slowly starting to fade the more that I touch it. I mean, yes, I am pressing pretty hard, but when you put that stuff in your waterline, it just, because it's only been like two hours, and it's almost gone in this eye. So it's almost gone on this eye and has run a little bit. And the top line, the top water line is good, or the top, I don't do my water, top water line. Anyways, um, I'll probably just continue to use it. Who knows? Anyways, guys, um, I'll check back in a couple hours and see if it's still going strong. It's, I did uh, put some setting spray. Um, my eyes are getting a little shiny though. It's one of the places where I get oily, my eyelids. Isn't that a weird place to get oily? Anyways guys, I'll check in in a few hours. Bye. Hi guys, Kelly here. Um, it's like 7 o'clock at night and all of it melted. Like, I will bring you in as close as I can get. And you can see all the fallout all along here. And here, it just like literally melted from on my eyes down to my cheeks. And that is completely unacceptable. No matter whether I was taking a nap or not, I have perfectly good eyeshadow. I have wet and wild eyeshadows that have stayed on my eyes through a nap. At, with setting sprays and... Uh, um, with setting sprays and primer and the fact that this stuff I mean there's even stuff up on my eyebrows and I'm not that much of a funky sleeper I mean it's even down here on my mouth It creased up in my corners. So, if you were looking, and I was in Walmart today, and I was looking to see if they still had another palette. And this palette is like $10. Ooh. By the way, these Signature Care Invigorating Cleansing Toilets that you get from Safeway don't get in your eyes. They burn like the seventh, uh, seventh inner circle of hell. Anyways, um, give me a moment. So <clears throat> I'm gonna go for a pass on the rock nudes. I mean, it's a pretty palette, and it really is nude, and I love the colors in it, but there is just so much freaking fallout when you put it on, and it's not vibrant at all, um, and it doesn't wow me, like at all, 
and that's important to me. I mean, you can see this is the gold, the gold color that I, the rose color that I used today. I want to call it rose gold, but and you can see how much I dug in there to get the product that I did. So I don't know. Let me guys, let me guys, let me know if you have this down below. If you've used it or what are your feelings on it? Um, so my eyebrows stayed on point. That's about it that stayed on point. I didn't do any other full makeup. I, I'm getting a lot of redness in my face and I don't know why and it's frustrating me. So that's it for this video guys and thanks so much for being here with me today. And I love you guys so so much and I hope that you'll subscribe and continue to keep watching me on my magical makeup journey. Journey? Journey. Journey? Whatever. It's like I said, I'm British all of a sudden. Journey. Anyways. Thank you guys again. And remember to stay you. Be beautiful. And stay strong. Bye guys. What? What? Oh my god! What is wrong with the kitten? Dean? Come here! Yeah? What is wrong with the little cat? What is wrong with the little boy cat? What is wrong with him? Poor cat! It's so hard to be you! Oh, little baby. Poor little boy cat. Oh, my goodness, is. Did, did Daddy take the, the doggies for a walk and you're stuck in here all by yourself? Oh, my God. The horror and the travesty of it. Oh, my God. Nobody loves you. Everybody hates you. You should go eat some worms. Poor little boy cat. This is Dean, everybody. He is about a year and a half old. He's a jerk. A huge jerk. Very, very huge jerk. And he's my dad's cat. Alright, bye guys.